Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been, I could say like six months that I haven't uploaded a video. And that's because, you know, life gets in the way. I, you know, I'm just busy, okay? So anyway, so hopefully um, this year I will get back into doing videos also because I have a new um vanity with super good lighting also if you can tell I am not in my normal what's it called yeah like if you can tell in my other videos I was in the same same um room now I'm in a different room um we moved again but anyways so today I want to talk about my acne story and yeah, basically I'm just gonna tell you how I dealt with my acne. I'm gonna show you products that I use that helped a lot. And yeah, I hope this video helps anyone who has acne or dealing with acne. Um, yeah, this hopefully helps. Anyway, so when I started getting acne when I was 18, um, right now I'm 20, well I'm gonna turn 20 in a week. So I, have not dealt with acne too too long like other people that I've heard stories about. I have a sister who she basically dealt with acne since she was like maybe like 11. I was pretty lucky that I, that I did not deal with acne throughout my middle school or high school. I started getting acne after high school when I turned 18. Um, I don't know why. Also, I did not wear any makeup so you guys could see how my skin looks right now because I think in my videos you or maybe you have I don't know but in my other videos I use makeup because I did not like to show all my agony anyways yes when I was 18 and it was funny because it's when I turned 18 or like a few weeks before eight, I was turning 18 I started getting a lot of pimples and yeah like throughout the throughout the years throughout the year I started to see my pimples get even worse and worse I used to get really bad pimples that like I had a big bump and it was it was those pimples that they were under your skin so they hurt so much so I remember I'll try anything to get rid of my pimples but it did not go so good my skin got irritated through um with so so many products um and I feel like I started getting it more more than I was like more than I had like instead of improving my skin with all those products it made it worse and maybe because to like I guess putting so much chemicals or products in my skin it irritated my skin keep in mind that I have really sensitive skin so maybe that's why but I think less is more so I remember I was I remember I I would go to Burlington Ross TJ Maxx um, buying mask that says it was for acne um yeah like a lot of masks um face washes i remember that i bought this neutrogena um wash a like face wash and it freaking i remember it made my um my face even worse and people were telling me that oh, it's because it gets worse um it gets to come yeah, like your skin's getting worse because that face wash is, that face wash is um, like sacando todo lo, lo que tienes abajo, que no sé qué. But I was like, no, I feel like it did not it did not work. So I stopped using that. That's why I do not buy any Neutrogena products because I feel like maybe it has so many chemicals or I'm allergic to that or I don't know. But yeah, I remember I, used, I was. I used to buy also the yes the 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 marca yes to um, mask also that made my skin really irritated. 
it's like every night I'll put mask and the next day I woke up with even more so yeah I remember that so I remember that year I did not like going out without makeup but I also did not like to wear makeup because I feel like it accentuated my acne even more but yeah because I feel like when I had makeup I feel like if people were talking to me people were staring at all the bumps that I had or whenever I had didn't have any makeup I feel like if I was talking to them they were looking at uh, my because I used to get I will get pimples here and in my cheek and they were pretty bad so yes that was that that was the first year and then there was a point where I gave up on my skin I felt like it does like I felt that it, I was wearing like I was buying so many products for my skin I remember I had like like and me peinador I had so many so many masks so many treatments whatever and I felt like it did not work I used to, I also tried like natural rem remedies but also it did not work so yeah so when so I turned 19 I I gave up pretty much I was like you know what whatever I saw this product that I heard I heard like a woman saying it helped her daughter's acne and bump because she had a lot of bumps acne and it helped her skin so I was like you know what okay I'll try it so I started using that product and I did see a difference as I started to see my skin getting a little bit better throughout the months of using it and I also started, I was researching um, this, I don't know if I can find it, but I don't, I don't use it no more because my skin did, it's clearing, my skin's pretty, pretty clear and I feel like I don't really need it. So it was, it's like a little roller needle that you roll it into your problem areas and it um, helps your acne, it helps the acne scars and I just used it, I used it like a month and I did see a difference but I stopped using it because I don't know, I just saw my skin improving and like I said, less is more. So when, so right now I am, oh shit, so right now I am going to turn 20 and this is how my skin looks like right now and I'm, I've, I remember I, I will always wear um, foundation, but now that my skin is so, so much better, I do not want to put any foundation. And if I do, like, I put really, really, really um, small, like, a really tiny, tiny foundation because, I mean, I don't know, I don't want my skin to irritate or anything. I'm like, I just don't want to jinx it. I don't want, I don't want to jinx my skin. Now I exfoliate my skin, I cleanse my skin. I I used to not be a huge skincare um, girl. I wouldn't even take care of my skin at all. But yeah, all the products that I'm gonna show you guys, I felt like that really, really helped my skin. And I hope it works for you guys. So, so whenever I use makeup, I take off my makeup with this. I, I, quate, I, quate? I don't know. It's okay. Um, beauty makeup remover towelet, and this is what I use. This is like the Walmart brand, but this, trust me, this is like the best um towelettes that I've used. Cause I also tried the Simply. Um, I also use my. I used to buy the Simply towels, and I feel like those didn't really take off my what's it called? my makeup i just use one of these and this takes off my whole makeup so after i so yeah that's important don't ever sleep with makeup on i feel like that also irritates your skin or i don't know but yeah don't do that so after so after i 
remove my makeup I go and with my Cetaphil cleanser I remember that I made a video about that I did not like it but after a while I did see I did really really like it um this removes my entire makeup like because you know with towelless they don't remove all, all your makeup so I use this with the little um brush spinning brush whatever and I remove my makeup with this and it does not leave my skin too dry and then once well, when I had really bad acne, I will exfoliate my skin twice a week or three times a week. But now since my skin it has gotten so much better, I use it once a week. So this is the Bump Rescue Exfoliating Cleanser with Charcoal. Bump Rescue Exfoliating Cleanser with Charcoal. And this is how it looks like. I don't remember where I bought it. But this is the, this is the one that I'm telling you that this lady told me that her daughter used it and it really helped her skin. And it worked for me. I feel like since I started using this, my skin did clear up so much. I don't know where you can get it. Just search it up and you'll find it. And it's not that expensive. So after I exfoliate my skin, I'll go in with a vitamin C serum. The vitamin C serum, um, it, I don't know if you can, I don't know. But this is a vitamin C serum this um brightens your skin and this also helped with my dark spots and yeah it brightens it brightens your skin so i feel like this also helped my acne also to remove it and whenever i'll do the roll the roll thing for your face the needle thing um i'll put this after and also i think that helped my skin so yeah vitamin c serum is oh i really love love this and i found this at tj maxx for it was in the clearance area for like three dollars and originally it was like eleven dollars so i'm so happy that i found this and i feel like i'm almost running out of it because every time i wash my face i use the vitamin c serum in my face so after after that i go in i go and moisturize my skin and these i'm gonna show you this is the three products that i use so this is the garnier skin active extra nutrition nutrition aloe vera and Al almendra and i'm already this is like completely gone because i really really loved how it moisturized my skin it did not like it does not leave my skin like with the, um like uh something what's it called because there's some skin products that they don't um go into your skin they just go like they just stay on top of it so, yeah and also my favorite um favorite moisturizer was the is this pond's dry skin moisturizer i just don't like how it smells it smells like viejita but it does really moisturize my skin i like how it feels on my skin and also what i usually mo use the most is this pond's dark spot correcting cream this also helped this also helped my acne i mean this also helped my dark spots and because of this it does it did really brighten like it did really remove my it did not remove it even it evened out my skin like my whole skin and yes and i really i love how this smells and this also moisturizes my skin i remember i i was a person who who was against moisturizing because I I'm oily and I felt like if I would like you know why am I gonna moisturize my skin moisturizers have oils and I felt like why am I gonna be adding more oils to my skin if I already have any more if I already have a lot of oil but I've learned that so because you do not add oils to your skin of course you're your body is going to produce even more oils and oils clog pores and pores make um makes your agony so i feel like that's why i also maybe that's why that helped clear my agony and yeah now i cannot moisturize i cannot go every night and every morning i moisturize my skin even before i do my makeup that, that because that also helps with my um it just makes my skin super super pretty so anyway 
so whenever i have really really like bad um pimples or like i get pimples i use this tree tea tree face and body oil it helps reduce inflammation and it does hydrate the skin and i got this big big bottle for five dollars at burlington and i just comes with little drops comes with little drops and this i just put it where i have my acne and then the next day it's the inflammation is like gone and my pimples get even smaller so i really really recommend um tea tree oil i i i sorry i bought this tree oil i bought this tree tea tree oil because i saw Cindaya like her skincare and yeah and i'm glad i found this so yeah that's pretty much it this video helps any of you guys and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in my next one bye